Hey everyone, hope you're doing well. It's Monday, we're about to go for a 20K run and just banging this one out, uh, starting the week off right. And I think we have a track session this week as well as a 30K long run. About 5K in. 8K in. Eighteen K in, legs definitely feel tired. We got two K left, and that's another day in the books. We're going to the track right now. It's gonna do some intervals, four K warm up, two by two kilometers, targeting sub eight minute pace for the two. A four K cool down. <laughs> Warming up, heading to the track. Alright guys, interval number one done. 2K, 7.29. Really happy with that to be honest. My goal for today was under 8 minutes to the 2Ks. Being 31 seconds ahead of schedule is a really good sign. Legs are feeling good. It's hard out there though. It's minus 10. We're grinding. This is the definition. Right here. We're out here in the snow doing work. Finished the second rep here, 1.2K. I was supposed to do two, I was feeling kind of out of it, had to adjust. That's just the way it goes sometimes, these workouts. You don't just cruise through them all the time, especially when you're on here on the track. I always said two most important workouts of the week are the track workout and the long distance workouts. And when, when you just can't get one of those, it's uh, pretty disappointing. We're about to head out 7.15 p.m. I'm extremely tired, but we're about to hit 20 miles. 20 mile run, that's 32 kilometers. We need to get this run and it's absolutely crucial for the training. It should be a good one. About two and a half K in, feeling good. Just past the 5K mark. We're feeling good, warming up. 27K to go. Just past the 10k mark, it was 49.05. These things will save your life on a long run. Just past 14k, we're going good, we're going good. 20k split, 136, we got 12k left. 23 and a half K in, almost two hours of running. You know, this is that point where you really have to get your mind in the game. This is really a focus moment. Just past the 26 K mark, we're almost done, final stretch. Just past the 30 K, 226. This is a really hard point, squeezing the sponge here. Mentally, physically, I don't recommend this. Just finished 31 and a half kilometers. Hey everyone, just wanted to debrief the month of January. It's coming to a close, so that means we're three months away from the Boston qualifying race. We're targeting again 258.30 for that race to get us into Boston. This month we ran about 360 kilometers total. That included three heavy weeks and one rest week after the vacation. The three heavy weeks included one medium run, one speed workout, one long run, and then the rest were filled with easy short runs. So the medium run was around 20 kilometers for this month. The long run was about 30. The speed workout was aggregate about 12 kilometers with some intervals. I think we made some really good progress. We were able to hit all our workouts this month. So that's a really good sign. The plan for the next week is to have a reduced volume week again 
It's the fourth week of the cycle, which means reduced volume. And that's going to help our bodies recover and take in what we just put it through. I feel no pain. There's no injury. I've been very diligent with stretches, foam rolling and exercises that I've showcased throughout this channel. I strongly believe that February is going to be even better, getting more and more experience as we go. I'm going to be showcasing more injury prevention technique. If you guys have any suggestions that you would like to see in terms of content, please let me know in the comments and I will address them as soon as possible.